Alrighty, welcome back. Uh, last episode, we had uh, a little bit of a failure here with the uh, with the guys. Uh, we're gonna do a quick long rest and uh, gonna go ahead and try to kill this hag. You don't sleep well, flitting between dreams and nightmares. Maybe you wake up because you know something is wrong. Or maybe you just get lucky. Is it the hag? Oh, it's Asterion. Ooh, he's a vamp- Ooh. Shit. He's a vampy boy. He's got, uh... No, no. It's not what it looks like. Bite marks in his I neck, I just realized. I... I wasn't going to hurt you. I... I just needed... Well... Blood. There, in the dim firelight, you see him for what he really is. A vampire, a slave to sanguine hunger. Yeah, it makes sense why he was being all hesitant about the boar now. Uh, let's not kill him though, he's been useful. Um... Oh, so that's why you were so quick to kill the Gur Hunter to it's keep not your what secret. You think. I'm not some monster. I feed on animals, boars. Deer, kobolds, whatever I can get. I'm just too slow right now. Too weak. If I just had a little blood, I could think clearer. Fight better. Please. All right. Fine. A strange sensation courses through you, and your companion's mind unfolds, secrets half revealed. Uh, yeah, let's look into his mind. Let's search for that truth. Jeez. Definitely I... succeeded that one. What's this? What's happening? Something stirs deep within you, hungry and alert. It's taking something you'll never get back. Wait, he already bit me in the neck? opens up, revealing cracked and quivering memories. At their heart, you see dark eyes commanding you to feed. You open your mouth and bite down, not into a tender neck, but into the twisting body of a rat, the only thing your master lets you eat. Oh, so he wasn't lying about that. I... Yes. Yes, I ate whatever disgusting vermin my master picked. So you can see why I'm slow to trust you. But I do trust you. And you can trust me. How can because I trust you? Because we don't you? have a choice. Not if we're going to save ourselves from these worms. I need you alive. You need me strong. Please, only be a taste, I swear. I'll be well, you'll be fine, and everything can go back to normal. Uh, let's do a quick save here, just in case he does kill me or something. Really? I... Of course. Not one drop more. It looks like he already bit me, though. Let's make ourselves comfortable, shall we? But now it's gone. Okay, that's probably a little glitch there. It's like a shard of ice into your neck. A quick, sharp pain that fades to throbbing numbness. Your breath catches. Your pulse quickens. All right, that's that's enough. I have to drive into his heart. Oh, actually, I have more persuasion. I just have to roll a one. Yeah, I'm I'm fine regardless. Mm. Mm. Oh, of course. That that was amazing. My mind is finally clear. I feel strong. I feel happy. 
his cards down, take a stake, throw it into his heart? No. Uh, I look forward to seeing you fight. Shouldn't take long. So many people need killing. Now, if you'll excuse me, you're invigorating, but I need something more filling. This is a gift, you know. I won't forget it. You watch as he stalks towards the forest, stronger, more confident, ready to hunt. Yeah, because he's a vampire spawn, so I don't think that turns into you, like lets you turn into a vampire yourself. Uh, let's talk to Asterion, I guess, really Good fast morning. here. How do you feel? Well, pretty shitty, probably. It'll pass. Just be glad I'm not a true vampire. A bite from them and you might wake up as a vampire spawn. Like my good self. All of a vampire's hunger, but few of their powers. Yeah. Oh, I've no idea. For 200 years, the sun would have turned me to cinders. Until the crash when I woke up bathed in its light. Someone, or something, wants me alive. They've changed the rules. Standing in the sun, wading through a river, wandering into homes without an invitation. They're all perfectly mundane activities now. As for my other quirks, well, <laughs> we can figure those out in time. Okay. Uh, we're in this together. <laughs> sure, why not? You're such a sweetheart. I'm just glad you're being sensible about these uh, revelations. I was worried people might turn up with torches and pitchforks. Although there's still time. A vampire? Well, that explains the pallor. Given our group's nature, I don't see much harm. We're each monsters in the making, after all. Oh, and a quick word of warning, Astarian. I taste absolutely awful. Keep your distance. <laughs> we need him, like it or not. I trust him, he won't hurt us. Uh, he won't hurt us. Oh, quite the opposite. I'm here in the spirit of oh. openness and honesty to work together as a team. Maybe we could get him to wear a bell. Dissuade any nighttime prowling. <laughs> there now. Like a sheep. We're all friends again. Shall we go? There's a long day ahead of us. Alright, let's go kill this hag. Let's go. Don't waste a step. I don't want a crumb left on that plate, girl. Auntie Ethel, please. One more bite, and this pie is gonna come back up to say hello. Don't make me get the wooden spoon. You're eating for two, so get to it. If it isn't the cheekiest pop of them all, you'd best have one hells of an apology for me, young man. I wanna just kill her. Yeah, just go. You Let's go. Absolute idiot! Oh, idiot. I idiot. An idiot? Oh, hello. A hundred and twelve health. Okay. Alright, that's... God damn, that's one sketchy looking hag. Hopefully those goblins don't come after me now. You blink and the wilderness changes. I'm gonna skip this because we already did that. Ah, shit. Uh, where is this goblin? Or where is Auntie Ethel, I really should say, I guess. Uh, where did she go? I won't give in. Uh, so hello? My feet can carry me. Did she just disappear? 
Where did she just go? Dude, where? What? Oh, I can't even catch my breath. Oh shit, she's invisible. Oh, that's bad. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm dead here. We'll see. Sometimes we'll see what happens. Something? I don't remember. Crap. Nice. Uh, let's make him visible too. gonna go that way. Nothing will stand in my way. <sighs> Can I still cast Bow of Emily on her? No, I can't because she's invisible. Crap. Okay, well. What bonus action can I do here? I feel like she was, like, here. Yeah, she is there. And let's end, I guess. Did I just... I'm an idiot. I just hit my own weapon. Okay, well... I use this. Wait, did I just... Okay, at least I killed one of them, right? Alright, this is already going better than last time. <laughs> She just went through the fireplace. Okay. Yeah, we're not gonna do that yet. However, do I have a grease bottle? See, because last time they were at way more of an advantage. But this time, let's uh, level the playing field a little bit. Where is the grease bottle? That's thrill. Oh wait, one is right here. Okay, screw that. Let's chuck it. These boots have seen everything. Mike. 
this guy. Yeah. Am I breaking the game currently? Uh, possibly. Let's shove him away though. Jump away. Oh, he is right next to me. Because with the high ground. Oh, you know what? I'm going to light them on fire with this. How did this guy not get. What? What? That's some cap right there. That is some serious cap. Let's drink a potion, buddy, and let's uh, back away. burning which is good and he dashed so he can't do anything let's try to yeah let's try to do that okay oh I have another action still Action, drink a potion. Save the friends, or merc him or fireball. No, sacred flames it is. Right. Okay. Uh I actually want to avoid getting will hit or gale hit, so. Shouldn't be close enough to hit me, yeah. Okay. Uh, finish him off. Wait, he's not hidden anymore. Okay, let's hide. Then shoot him. Nice. Then walk up closer. Shoot him from here? I can't, right? Yeah. 
Another step forward. Use whole person. Oh, is that a well that you can go down? Oh, he's gonna try to hide in that well. Onward. I mean, not if I can help it, but uh, he's probably gonna get away. I don't want him finding more goblins or something. I'll use health blocks. Cause he's just trying to run away at this point. Oh, that's cute. Step to it. Now they see me. What? What? I'm such a dingus. Don't linger. Take all this crap. This guy's hand. Alright, let's do a short rest here. Let's go hurt someone. And I'm done because there's acid on the floor. Uh, let's go into the fireplace. Okay, she full on ran away, so let's let's see what I can loot from here. Spoiled treckle tart, bottle, a glass distillation set. Okay. Mugwort, sure. Let's steal that. I don't really care. Nice potion of greater healing. I'll take it. There's incense down there. Alright, fine, whatever. Speed. Spoiled trickle tart. White bread. A toad teapot. Butter bun. Okay, that 
let's have him make poison. Animal speaking. Some stuff. I'll take the pig's head, why not? Tea house key. Try that out. Rotten tomato? No, I'm good on that. Thank you. There's something down here. No one back home will ever I think. This. There better be. This is like a perfect spot for something. Okay, why not? Let's get Ready Will or Gale to use something on that arcane barrier. Path less traveled. Stone. Even worse a second time around. Okay, well, I guess I can't do anything with that. I will have to use another short rest. Okay, so... Great. Let's just walk around for a bit longer to get rid of that debuff. Oh, well, it's a solid debuff. Greater healing potion over here. Sorry, I know this is like the loot simulator game right now. <laughs> I am trying to make it not so. Rotten? No, but I'll take that potion of healing. I'll take an antidote. Rotten mushrooms. No, I'm good, thanks. Okay, now now we can continue here. Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. Why is Asterion not coming? Let's go. Still alive, so that's progress. Moving in. Still breathing, despite everything. All right, let's go down the scary wooden stairs. Okay. Uh, I don't like this. Thank you for saving for me, game. in stasis.
watery eye is what makes you turn. Do I have, uh... Can my... They come, sweetness. Okay. This is my personal playhouse, and you don't have an invite. Get out! I guess I can have God's to. God's alive, a paladin. You lot are drier than shite in the noonday sun. I've picked plenty of your brethren from my teeth, Petal. And I look forward to seeing how tasty you are. Okay. Ah! But where the, where the hell is she? Is she still... Where the hell is she? You feel crushing waves of fear as the presence within the door recoils. It can't let people through, not again. Images flash. A man cowering, a bag open at his feet. Gold coins spilling onto the floor. His cries for mercy are cut short as the hag slices into him, dismembering him painstakingly, limb by limb. Oh, she this chick is gonna die for sure. The man's remaining flesh, twisted and contorted, becoming the twisted surface of the door before you. Oh, well, we definitely gotta kill you then. You feel it cry. Frustrated, the door rattled. You see the hag and yourself. You lay bleeding as she leans over you, a smile on her face. Her teeth, a row of deadly needles, shine as they dive into your throat, blood spraying. The dagger will hide first. Twitches, but stays firm. Come on, door. The freaking door. I'm being defeated by a door right now. Okay, no, I'm not. There we go. The door shudders, imagining its wooden frame cracking and splintering in a raging inferno. You see the hag. She walks through the door, its form shimmering. Okay. With a jerk, you're pulled from the vision. You feel the presence within shrink, terrified. Okay, so it's in her. Stop! No, no! Don't look! Mustn't look! Mustn't see! I see it! I see what's to come! Me... Dead... Dead! Flesh rotten, bone shining! Uh... Look at me. No! No! Can't stop! Can't! Gods... Don't hurt me! Oh, please! Please! Please, please, please! You're safe no. with me. No! Monster! A mind dripping! Flesh peeling! Mind player! 
I'm not a mind flayer. No! Mind flayer! Get away! Get away! Oh, okay. No uh, Can I loot anything else here? Don't look. Don't That's uh My darling madam. She wished for the mind of a genius. <sighs> that silly head. Rust me. I don't know what this perception was here. On I go. My sweet Callum, whose beloved art that is beauty. Okay, before I press this mirror, I definitely want to save. Edge closer to the mirror, a pale face appears, contorted in fear. Fists slam against the mirror's surface again and again. Can I destroy the mirror? I received Bane. That's not fun. give her something that she's actually proficient in if she can't use that. Is she proficient in those? Proficiency bonus. Javelin spears. And this is a spear. What is this? What is this? Yeah, it's a spear. Okay. I can't do anything about that. And now, like, everyone in my party has Bane. Uh, I need to take a, a long rest now to get rid of this status affection. Oh no, oh no, oh no, I didn't want to do that. Feel crushing waves of fear as the presence within the scene appears. Weapons branded, screams of terror pierce the air. You let them in? Naughty. That's a decade for each. You're mine for thirty more years, Pekka. Hmm. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna leave. Uh, and then go to a long rest really fast. Stop. Okay, well, Please. I guess I can. Please. Feel the barest hint of light from... Okay, how do I get through them? A thief no. who tried to steal Don't. from Auntie. Now the good little pet guards my home. My Stop. gentle lover. He wished Please. to know what was to come. What does the whispering mask do? Well, I have a lot of things. Do I have to wear it? Hello, pet. My, my, the mask suits you. Just relax. See the world with fresh eyes. And let your dear old Aunt Ethel look after you. Oh, okay, you can just walk through, okay. Take the mask off now? I feel 
feel like I should take the mask off now. Yeah, okay. Oh, there's things to kill in here, okay. a firm of whispers do. Oh, okay. trying not to attack. Okay, let's do greater healing potion here. And... jump up there? No, I can't. Okay. Jeez. Oh, no, Gale. Don't die. Dude, Gale is just so freaking weak. And I'm dumb because I keep forgetting to swap this out. Yeah, let's get him up. He's literally gonna die next turn anyways. Um, wait, he can still take damage from spells? I guess... Give him shield fate. That's kind of a waste, but fine. Okay, now Gale is dead again. Okay. 
Okay. Go down, he's like a healer. Nice. Very nice. Sheesh. Healing potion and Days. Okay, well, let's move it here, and let's go ahead and, um, uh, yeah, am I sneaking? I am. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Perfect. And let's go ahead and bonus action hide. Okay, well then let's move. Actually, can I jump? fights here. I gotta help him up. Oh, he's, he's full on dead. Okay. That's useless. Nice. Okay. Uh, Gale, I'll have to get you up later. I'm sorry, bud. Climbed up then if I'm gonna climb right back down. Time for a new approach. Oh no, okay. Um I can see him. I 
let's just shove him off the edge. Projection of Gale of Waterdeep. And if you see this manifestation, that means I have prematurely perished. However, for reasons that cannot be disclosed, it is of vital importance that my death be remedied at your earliest convenience. Yeah, obviously. You may rest assured that I do not speak out of self preservation alone. Many lives depend on my return to the living within the span of two days. Yeah, I'm going to use this color resurrection. I trust I've made myself clear. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have upon my deceased person a magical item that can accomplish my return. But such is the value and rarity that it is protected by a multi-layered security protocol. Okay. I will now explain the protocol. Step one is to retrieve from my person a pouch I wear over my heart. Next, you must unthread the purple seam that seals it in a counterclockwise fashion. Do not touch any other colored strand. All right, purple seam, kind of Inside the pouch, you will find a folded letter and a tiny flute. Unfold the letter and note the markings in the top and bottom corners. These are the notes you will need to play. Starting from the bottom right, play the notes in correct order, clockwise this time. Upon completion of the tune, a magma method will appear, which will pose the following question. Iskcha Chisnaga. This is Ignan for what is my name? The answer is Kasi Trak Ash. Pronounce the name correctly and the method will breathe on the letter. Stay clear because the little scamp can melt metal. Okay. Words will now appear on the letter's surface, effectively turning the letter into a scroll of true resurrection. Use it to bring me back to life. Okay, got it. Uh... Excellent. Now repeat my instructions back to me, please. I got it. Seems not a lot. Yeah. In that case, this will be an easy exercise. Step one. Touch the purple thing. Which, uh, the pouch. And next. Purple pouch. Purple right. seam. Yeah. You then have access to the letter and the flute. Go on. Uh, bottom right? Remember to play them clockwise. And after that? Uh, Kishish Ash. Tretch Ash. This one? Correct. But pay attention to the trap part. Kh Kh is back of the throat. And so we have gone through the necessary steps again. Best of luck with the protocol. May my cold, dead hands soon be refilled with the warmth of life, so they can shake yours in gratitude. Okay. Um. Let's do this. I don't have to be in. Can I just have him go there? Everybody freaking taking damage. What is this? Alright, whoa, 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 whoa. What is happening here? Is he like necrotic? We done being nec necrosized here. Delicious. All right, you guys ungroup. And can't.
can't I just use a scroll of revivify on you? Can we can we not just keep it simple? Yeah, yeah we can. Please help me. My hands are still cold, so that handshake will have to wait, but in the meantime. Thank you. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go. Oh. It's a relief to be back on beautiful Faerun. The dreariness of the fugue plane oppresses one's soul so very quickly. That said, I assume you have some questions for me. Only fair to warn you I have precious few answers to spare. I apologize if that sounds thankless. It's just that some secrets simply cannot be revealed. Just tell me when that's, you're ready. Yeah. Well, that's very kind of you. If the roles were reversed, I don't know if I'd have your patience. You brought me back to life, and for that, I am in your debt. I was surrounded by danger. It could happen again. If it does, bring me back again. You must, for the sake of many. All right, let's... Oh, no, you can't fast travel. Okay, let's uh... Tiring business, isn't it? All this. Why don't we take a little break? Hmm? Allow ourselves a few moments of rest? Gives me a chance to talk to you about something. Well, rather important. Um. We've been on the road together for a while now, haven't we? Survived some perils, overcame some obstacles. Jeez, these Ever episodes since you are getting long. Enough to free me from that stone, I've seen you demonstrate remarkable guile and courage. The way you got Korga to release the girl, the way you followed the protocol and brought me back to life. In short, I've grown to trust you. Well, I haven't really do that. The reason I make a point of saying this is that I've grown confident enough to tell you something I've yet to tell another living soul except for my cat you see I have this condition very different from the parasite we share but just as deadly uh, what the kind of condition are rather personal but suffice it to say that it is a malady I've learned to live with and not without some effort what it comes down to is this Every so often, I need to get my hands on a powerful magical item and absorb the weave inside. Okay. I can say no more on the matter. Not now, anyway. Just trust me when I say it's all of vital importance. It's been days since I last consumed an artifact, and before we were abducted. Only a matter of time before my craving returns. That is why I turn to you. I need you to help me find magic items to consume. It is vital. Dare I say it? Okay. Critical. Critical. Got it. Yes. Um. I'd be happy to help. You have my thanks. And fear not. Your implicit trust is well placed and will be rewarded with any and all means at my disposal. I'm sure we won't have to look very far to find what I need. Faerun overflows with magic-infused treasure. As do our packs, as a matter of fact. We have such an item already in our possession. Prime for the moment the need arises. Okay, do you need it now? Okay, um, yeah, let's get out of here. Because, uh, well, I got to... Wear this crown again here. Stench Did I just of fail? Is a slap to the face. Suddenly she is there, oh, beside you, behind you. So bad. Inside you. Yes, I have you now. <laughs> Generic immutable object. Don't worry. Auntie is going to take good care of you. Come on.
Come on, baby. Nope. I didn't. I failed. Yep. Yeah, I gotta, gotta get out of this. No, come on. I gotta get out of this. One more, one more, one more. What is up with these low rolls? Last chance. Otherwise I die and have to reload, I think. Okay. This game hates me. Okay. Nice try, little paladin. Pity a lack conviction. Did I save? We're not in combat, except I have no spell slots. That's nice. Okay. No time to waste. All right, let's try to get out of this. All right, come on. Okay, what kind of potions do I got right now? Let's... That's light armor, I want to keep light armor on. my own guy Uh, let's take five and uh, retry that encounter. <laughs> All right. See you guys on the next one. That was kind of bad, but uh, <laughs> we'll get it. We'll get it.